All right, guys, I just popped this one out. It was deep now. It was probably six, seven inches, eight inches deep, and it's got a lot of fill in this yard. And I just spotted it there. It's right here on the edge. I'm hoping it's a weed at least. It's got some green coloring to it, doesn't it? Hey guys, Missouri Mike back again today. Hey, <clears throat> hunting this old place right here, and boy, I hadn't found much yet, but you know, you never know what you're gonna dig, so I got my lucky hat on today. It's got the flag on it, you can see that. And uh, having a good time though. Jeff's around the corner. Chris Nelson, and the buddy, he's out there in the field. And uh, I got a real scratchy signal here, and I just popped one of these out. We find a lot of these. In this state and um, always like finding them though they're pretty cool this one's kind of chewed up let me show you what I got here right back with you cool. on my first decent find I guess what you would call it is a Missouri sales tax token and it kind of come in as a choppy signal get her to focus in there but uh, always happy to have those even though you find one you find a lot of them Pretty cool piece of history there. Got the Missouri State on it with a one in the middle, so that's a one mil. It's kind of chewed up, but they made them real thin back then. They didn't have any money, so they made these out of zinc. And that's down about, oh, it was a good eight inches. This yard's got a lot of fill in it. So, anyway, I'm happy to have that. So, I'll tell you what, let's go on and see what else we can get. Probably gonna leave out here pretty quick and go get on another one, so stay tuned. Now, I've hunted that whole side over there. Didn't find nothing but rose tags. Found several. So I come over on this side here and just pop this out. So let's get another one. Hey guys, Jeff's over there and Chris Nelson is right there. And I just popped me out a weed head. I don't know if you can see how old it is. I think it's just a 40s model. Right in this unit right here. And so that's my first weed of the day. So I got one. Um, we'll see if we can get another one. Just getting going on this yard. Started over there. And I've worked my way through here. Well, I ain't found much anything. I just popped this out of the ground. It's like it's an old bullet. I don't think it's just super old, but it's got enough to be white patina on it, so it's got some age to it. That's pretty cool. All right. Not much here, so keep digging, see if we can find something else. Nice yard, though. I'll get back with you on the next target. I just popped this signal out there where that wormy's at. Just flipped it out here. Let's check it out together, see what it is. Oh my gosh, I think it's an Indian. It is. It's going to be an Indian. Oh, made my day. I've only found two or three coins a day. But there it is. $18.99. All right. All right, all right, all right. Man, I am happy to have that. Long time coming on that one. Finally. Finally got an Indian today. I ain't found much, but I did get Indian. It's getting ready to rain, so we probably won't stay much longer, but I am happy to have that. I am happy to have that one. $18.99. All right, let's get some. Guys, Jeff and I are out having a little day today. It's gonna come a rain today, so we're out here doing a little digging. Boy, it's cool out today, too. I got my hoodie on. I put on some weight. The coronavirus has got me going. But I just dug my first hole here. I'm going to show you what it is. And uh, down about uh, probably four, four or five inches. So let's check it out together. Creep in on this real quick. And right there it is. See it? It's a, it is a, hopefully it's a weed head. I see it's a Lincoln on one side. It is a weedy. All right. Weedy number one. Had a wheat. 
<laughs> all right not a old one i don't think but still cool let's go get another one all right guys you got me a piece of a harmonica reed here so i've hunted all the way up through here got one wheat penny and one harmonica reed so far not a good sign but we can keep going and uh find a lot of these this is just a little old piece of it but we'll go on see what else we can get before the rain hits all right guys i just popped this one out it was deep now it was probably six seven inches eight inches deep and it's got a lot of fill in this yard and I just spotted it there it's right here on the edge i'm hoping it's a weed at least it's got some green coloring to it doesn't it Yep, I see Lincoln on that side. So, yep, greeny. One center. Let's see if we can get a quick date for you. Mm. Yeah, I don't think it's going to be as old as I was hoping for. Nope. It's a 40s model. All right, let's go on. I'm happy to have that though. Second weedy of the day. All right, guys, down about four inches or so. Moving to weedy number three. That's our red one. Another looks like a 40s model, maybe. That one wasn't quite as deep as the last one. Boy, it didn't come in very good though. All right, let's get another one. Hey guys, we're in a new spot now. And uh, I just started hunting right over here. I'll show you where I've been. So I've hunted all this right over in here. And started out, and a lot of field dirt in here. But I just popped this dude out. And it looks like a John Deere tractor. I'm not sure if that's a Tootsie model. It's pretty old though. It's got plastic wheels, so. Probably from the 40s or so. It's still pretty cool find. All right, what's in good shape too? That's one of my first tractors I've ever found. I'm loving it, what's in good shape? That's one of them ones that tip over real easy. Got the two front wheels on it. It says John Deere on the side, so that's in pretty good shape really, believe it or not. I'm happy to have that. We will take that and go on. See what else we can get, guys. Let's pop this out. It's pretty cool. I don't know for sure if it's got any writing on it, but it's an old piece of brass. Went on something at one time. Looks like it's hinged right here on the end. Well, that's pretty cool. I was wishing it was a dog tag or something, but it ain't. But anyway, really it really was a weird signal. I'll clean it up better later, but let's see what else we can get. All right, guys, I just popped this dude out. It was down here pretty deep. It's on kind of an angle. Maybe another one down there. But anyway, there's the one that I popped out. Let's see what it is together. I'm hoping it's at least a wheat. Yep, looks like it's going to be a wheat head. Old one, though. I do believe, yep. 1927 all right is that a s stamp i can't tell all right let's go on guys missouri mike back again i'm hunting this unit here behind me i just pulled out a really cool target let's see what it is together all right it looks to be like it's going to be silver maybe Looks so well, let's clean it up later. That kind of looks silvery to me. It may not be. Mm, kind of cool though. Some kind of clip off something. Alright, let's go on. So I started out in here. I've worked all this. I got one wheat penny, one silver thingy looking, and then this right here. <clears throat> looks like that's going to be a crushed thimble. 
it's not silver or anything. I'll have to clean it up later. That's a cool find though. Down about six, seven inches. That's my deepest target here so far. A lot of clad. A lot of clad money. I'm not digging anything shallow because it's all clad. So anyway, that's cool. Alright. Clean it up later. I don't think it's silver or anything. Still cool though. Alright, let's get another one. Alright guys, I just spotted my coin down there in the bottom of that hole. Down about five, six inches. I'm hoping it's at least a weed head. Let's see what it is here. Yeah, it is a weed. I do believe. I don't get a date on it or not. 1936. All right, that's a good one. That's in good shape. Underneath this old magnolia tree right here. Beautiful old magnolia. What a nice sunset, huh? There's the white rooster. All right, let's go on. Hmm, get another one. All right, guys, I just popped my third weed head out. 19... 43. No. It's 1945. Alright. At number three. Let's go on.